Good afternoon. I'm Marie Saavedra. Great to have you with us. I'm Joe Donlin. We begin here at five with a new lead in the search for the gunman who shot someone at a popular South Loop diner on Friday. Delegates from the DNC were inside the White Palace Grill when shots rang out, many of them diving under their tables. RSL resides live for us outside the restaurant as police are releasing surveillance photos of the suspect. Us out. Yeah, Marie Joe, Chicago police hoping someone can help identify the man they believe opened fire inside this restaurant that was packed with people from the DNC. These are the latest surveillance photos from inside the White Palace Grill on August 23rd. The suspect was captured on video, firing a gun at a man, shooting him multiple times. Getting shots fired 1200 South Canal. You can see the word officer across his shirt, and while he appears to be wearing some type of badge on his hip, it is not known whether he's a security guard, but we do not believe he is a Chicago police officer. Video also captured this silver Ford Focus driving away from the crime scene. Javier Mabry, a Colorado state representative, told us last Friday half the restaurant was full of people from the Democratic National Convention. All of a sudden, we just heard gunshots, and they were very, very close. He said he heard at least eight gunshots. All of us got down immediately under the tables. A security guard that was getting off of his shift at the restaurant says things escalated after a man tried to bring alcohol inside. And that security guard, he stepped in, told him he can't do it, and I guess he, the guy felt some type of way, and he was going back and forth with the security guard. But That's when gunshots rang out. A 42-year-old man was shot and taken to the hospital in fair condition. We don't have an update on that victim's condition at this time. Police are asking anyone who knows or sees that suspect to call 911. I'm live in the South Loop. That's all reside. CBS New Chicago. SL, thank you.